what's up guys it's me idris87 welcome back to the channel today i'm just gonna take a little tour and show you guys my game room so sit back and relax and enjoy the footage and as always guys feel free to leave a comment leave a like and please consider subscribing so from idris87 let's take the tour okay guys so this is the game room as you can see so let's just do a quick guide tour whatever you want to call it let's get it started so as you can see on top there that's my little mountain of Funko Pops going down that's my PlayStation 4 collection now I'll just move the camera along slowly so you can get a look at each game Okay, going down, this is my GameCube collection, it's quite small at the moment, that's my Xbox 360, you can check that out, Xbox 360, and those are my Xbox One games, but before I get to those, let me just show you these little guys here, these are Pixel Pals. They're pretty cool little 8-bit figures and basically all they do is just uh, light up and surprisingly enough they actually give off pretty good light so yeah you guys should pick those up moving along that's the uh, Xbox One games as you can see there those two games right there pretty good games okay we're moving down this is uh, just a bunch of PlayStation 3 games, as you can see, with some more Funko Pops. There's Thanos, Master Chief, Carnage, and The Flash. So let me just move these guys out of the way, and you can see some more PlayStation 3 goodness. Let's get Flash out. So yeah, that goes for the PlayStation 3. Okay, moving down. That is my PlayStation Vita collection. I'd say it's a pretty decent collection that I have of those. Then those are my Xbox. Original Xbox games. Going down to the last shelf. There's some comic books. As well as my... PlayStation 2 collection that I have there. Very good. Okay, so moving on from those to the next shelf. This is my Nintendo Switch games. As you can see, some pretty good games there. These are just some random loot crate figures that I got over the months. That's the awesome Starlink Battle for Atlas figurine. That is just uh, some more Mario figures. I have one Sega Saturn game, some Genesis games, some more Genesis games, Sega Saturn games, as you can see there. Those are 3DS games. Hi Toad, Pokemon, Pokeball, Super Smash, Power Rangers, and some Wii and Wii U games. Um, I'm actually planning on doing a review for this little arcade game. It's a pretty cool thing. Uh, just a bunch of Sega games on there, but I'll maybe do a review of that. Moving along to the next shelf. Here's a Sega CD game, Metroid Prime figure, some Dreamcast games, nice little Rick and Morty figure. Uh, Rick and Morty is awesome. Little Dungeons and Dragons Dice Keeper. That's my PS1 collection that I have there. Moving on, 
full out boy some nice little bootleg Super Nintendo game Batman Forever and those are just a bunch of Super Nintendo games at the back actually Super Famicom oh, and Super Nintendo going down there there's just my row of N64 games as you can see Mario Kart always in front there's the Ice King couple of PSP games some Famiclone games Yoshi's Cookie as you can see those are my NES games as you can see Blaster Master, Mickey Mouse Capade, Monster Party uh, Zelda, Turtles, Mega Man the list goes on and there's quite a few more at the back as you can see Super Mario Bros so yeah that does it for all my games so let's check out the consoles so as you can see there nice little NES and the Famiclone the new 3DS Super Nintendo or Super Famicom I should say the Wii U tablet my Wii Wii U N64 the old 3DS Game Boy Color Nintendo DS XL and GameCube so basically that's just my <laughs> Nintendo shelf so going down to Sega we have the beautiful Sega Saturn of course with the action replay this is my Japanese version of the Dreamcast the Sega CD Sega Genesis okay it does it for Sega going down to PlayStation we have the PlayStation TV the fat PS3 the PlayStation tablet I actually haven't used that before the slim PS2 fat PS2 PS Vita PSP old school PS1 PS1 mini and the PSP box okay so going further down the line we have the Xbox 360 Elite that's my Super Nintendo Classic the Brawler 64 and two Xbox the original Xbox so these this one is the Pell this one is the Pell but it's modded so I just copy games of the hard drive and there you go so going down to the last shelf that's the Super Retron HD Mega Retron HD the Retron HD Nintendo Mini Nintendo Switch and the Dory Flashback 8 okay so going to the next shelf we have some Starlink figures on this shelf so here's the one that is a uh, Yoshi's Mega Yarn the Amiibo some Hyrule Warriors that's the limited edition games with a game and uh, a little clock the Tiny of Pac-Man Arcade I'm actually going to do a review on that it's pretty good well not good the uh, emulation on that is quite bad but uh, it's cute you know so Mario Rabbits also the collector's edition a nice Fallout 4 figure Fallout the uh, power armor figure I should say that's a Sonic and these two actually came in a uh, loot crate subscription so you guys should check that out you can see uh, my Xbox One this is the this is the uh, first one that came out you know the big fat one and this is actually a little gift that my wife got me and I really love this gift it's a light up Mario coin when you you know hit the coin that makes that sound that's pretty cool going down is my uh, Dreamcast that's just the box of the Japanese one and there is 
Super Mario Maker for the I think it's the Wii U yeah and just some more figures you know from Loot Grid as you can see here another Mario Rabbits figure like Luigi this over here is actually uh, Meta Sonic or Metal Sonic I forget the name and that figure is actually built quite flimsy because as you can see the arms broke off from this figure so I actually need to glue those back so uh, going down these are some more of the uh, Starlink Battle for Atlas figures there's my Xbox One that I'm currently using PlayStation 3 Slim and the uh, Star Wars the uh, the droid you can actually control that with your smartphone so that's pretty cool and there's just a uh, loot crate box at the back so let me just check this thing out this original Xbox console box is just full of uh, Game Boy Advance and Game Boy cartridges and a heck of a lot of controllers as you can see there and this is actually my copy of Starlink for Nintendo Switch you can check out a nice Mario mat that's pretty cool <laughs> so I'm almost done with the tour guys so let's just check out these little canvas paintings it's pretty cool I like Iron Man a lot he's a cool guy and you can see another Iron Man figure going down there is Thor that's pretty cool actually I want to get more of these canvases okay so the last shelf is just my little figurine collection so these this is a Batman as you can see very big good looking guy and that's a Superman very cool looking so those are just another pair of uh, low trade figures and these are all my amiibos I have you know the uh, I forget the name now of these games there's Mario all the Zelda figurines, amiibos, canon those are the heroes of Breath of the Wild, the champions um, oh yeah, I remember the name was uh, Fire Emblem Silica and Arm, so those are pretty cool my little Mega Man figure Alien figure, those two are from Blood Crate as well you can see there, nice Kratos and Atreus figure it's pretty cool looking with his axe that actually came with the uh, collector's edition so it's pretty cool I like that figure a lot and going down this is a just a cover for actually a shell to put over your Xbox 360 Slim it's a Gears of War shell and yeah Gears of War and this little skull right here it actually lights up that's pretty cool when you power up your console so you can see there another loot crate box Cog Krispies it's pretty funny box and these are, these are two Super Nintendo Bluetooth controllers these are the 8-bit uh, DOE controllers that's my Super Smash Bros Ultimate Collector's Edition box Going down to the last shelf, that is the God of War Collector's Edition Ah, PlayStation Mini mm, Real waste of money But uh, uh, it's PS1 in HD uh, Going next, this is some uh, Pokemon cards and the PlayStation VR so that does it guys for the game room let's give a quick look around again
yeah so that does it for the gaming room tour guys i hope you guys had fun thank you for watching so guys that's my game room this is my video for today so please let me know down in the comments what you guys think of it do you like it i know it's not the biggest game room but it's my little humble game room so thank you guys for watching from me 87 you guys take care i'll see you in the next one